half of our prayers that come in are for others. We're loving people, we're spiritual people, and therefore we're concerned with others. We love other people, and we want them to have the highest and the best in life. The highest and best that we could ever wish for or pray for another is God's presence to be in their life, guiding them, helping them, healing them. Well, our instruction in the Bible, in James 5.16, says pray for one another. Well, today we bless others in our prayers. In the quiet of prayer, we enter a holy sanctuary and we release our day-to-day -day cares in this moment and concerns and we focus on the truth that we are one with the Christ and those that we care for, our dear ones, are one with the Christ. One in God, we are one with all creation. We are centered in prayer now. We are under the umbrella of God's all good. We immerse ourselves in an awareness of our oneness with God. And in this awareness, we are joined in harmony, in a harmonious union with all of life. And in one love, the love of God, we are joined together in one light. We have the light and illumination of God coming through our minds and guiding us, making us strong in our walk. We bless others today. We bless them in the love of Jesus Christ. We bless them in our highest thoughts, in our highest positive prayers about the best possible outcome coming in their lives, knowing they are one with God. In the innermost part of our being, we join in prayer with friends and with loved ones and also with people all over the world. We send forth a broadcast of prayer blessings to everyone and our prayers for others are positive affirmations of truth about them, that they are whole in God, that they are well, in God and they're inspired in God to live a life that is dedicated to demonstrating the highest Christ ideals of life and love and peace. We pray that whenever we think of another person we think of them in the highest way not with human doubt or human worry but knowing that God is with them right now. And knowing that God is with them right now, there is a power, a positive prayer power that goes forth from us to touch the other person. There is no time or space in prayer. And we know that in prayer, we are spiritually connected. And others feel our positive prayers. They're uplifted in them and fed by them spiritually. We pray that every prayer that we pray will be a blessing not only to ourselves but also to others. And We pray that we are a light in our world in prayer by lighting the way for someone and others that we may know, that we may not know, that find themselves in temporary darkness. In Jesus Christ's name, we pray and we give thanks for the incredible opportunity and the privilege. Amen.